my name is Alicia, I'm one of the performance coaches at Vector Health and today I'm going to show you some jumping and landing techniques. Um, so the first one, really simple, just two to two. So two foot takeoff, two foot land. So you're just simply jumping up and then you want to stabilise that landing. So you just want to make sure you land feet flat on the ground, knees um, going outwards and you want to stick the landing. Okay, so the next progression after that is your two foot takeoff, one foot land. So, same thing, we're going to jump up, use your arms to jump, jump up, stabilise that landing, one foot. You want to make sure when you land that we're not wobbling or your knees not going different places. You jump up and you land, you really want to stabilise that. So you do that one side, obviously, then you jump up, do the other side, same thing. Okay, the next one after that is your rebound jumps. That's just two feet and you're just jumping off the ground, so rebounding off. So you use your arms still, powering through, just little jumps, and as you progress forward, you just start nice and slowly jumping off. Um, as you progress and you want to make it harder, you want to spend less time on the ground. So like I just said, jumping off on your toes. <laughs> Okay, next one is broad jumps. That's just two foot takeoff, two foot land, and you want to jump as far forward as you can. This is working on stabilise that landing. So, similar thing, you use your arms, you want to swing back, jump forward as far as you can, you want to stabilise that landing. So, nice soft landing, it would be landing on our toes and then tipping forward, keeping our chest up nice and tall. Another variation to that is the same thing, doing a broad jump, but this time you're trying to get as much height as you can, a little bit like a triangle. You want to go up really high and then you still want to land further up. So similar thing, you still want to use your arms and you want to jump up as high as you can. So you want to swing back with your arms, jump up, and then you want to land that. A really good tip when doing that is to swing your arms up really high. It gives you more power when you jump. Um, the next one is lateral jumps, so that's just working on your landing once again and you definitely want to stabilise your ankles when you land. So if you're jumping sideways, use your arms, power up, jump and you want to land. You want to make sure that when you're landing you're not doing one foot at a time. You still want to get that height when you're doing it, but you want it to be nice and steady when you land. <laughs> These jumping landing techniques are perfect skills for all sorts of sports. Specifically, I use them a lot for netball and I use them when coaching netball. Um, have a go at these progressions. If you'd like to learn more, feel free to book an appointment or give us a call and I can take you through them.